What would you do differently if you knew where people were sick and what was ailing them at all times? Much like toys and electronics, illness is seasonal. But unlike other businesses, illness seasons don't have reliable guideposts to plan around. In fact, flu season varies widely from year to year and place to place, both in timing and severity. Nobody knows how it will play out until it's too late. This unpredictability makes it difficult for you, the makers of disinfectants, tissues, and cold remedies to reach the people who need you most. What do you do today? You could try to estimate flu activity from social media or web searches, but these methods are often inaccurate and misleading. The CDC's flu data is accurate, but has limited value as reports lag by many weeks and don't offer much geographic detail. Kinsa's data is almost perfectly aligned with the CDC, but it doesn't just come in sooner, it comes in live and with zip code level geographic precision. We have the first accurate real-time map of human health, powered by millions of inputs from households in every U.S. market. How? Kinsa was founded with a mission to track and ultimately curb the spread of illness. To do this, we invented the first FDA-cleared smart thermometer to build a two-way communication system with the ill. With Kinsa, families don't just get a number readout, they get guidance on what to do next. In turn, our thermometers are anonymous sensors of real-time fever, symptom, and illness levels in local communities. The information Kinsa gathers is fed back to our users so they know what's going around and can react appropriately. On a broader scale, this real-time illness information can inform so much more, enabling you to know where people are sickest and with what symptoms. What would you do differently with Kinsa? Would you allocate your marketing budget more cost-effectively, bringing the right solutions to the right people at the right time? Learn how Kinsa can help you today, before the next illness season catches you by surprise.